That's interesting. <laughs> <laughs> well, I really am, Louie. Do you want to see my magic trick? Of course. Now then. Is there a daring volunteer to help in my amazing magic trick? Me, me, me! That's a surprise. Everyone welcome the very brave Sophie. Well done, Sophie. Ready for the joke? Oh, yes. Very good, Sophie. Look straight into my eyes. Abracadabra, abracadabra. And now, Sophie, you're feeling sleepy. Sleepy. Et voila! Bravo, Jumbo! Well, <laughs> but of course, I am impressed, Joko. But you know, I am also a great magician. Oh, yes? Yes, because I, I am going to wake Sophie up again. Don't move. I'll be back. Whatever happens, don't wake up. All right? All right. Ta da! Oh, look out! He's here! I, the great magician Louis, am going to wake up Sophie. So I'm going to draw a cockerel. A cockerel? <laughs> a cockerel will never wake Sophie up. Wait, we will see. To draw a cockerel, I start with the head, a little flat on top. And. I'm adding a little pointy beak and a dot for his eyes. And next, I draw his back and then I move across to give him large tail feathers. And then I go back down and I draw one side, a line for his tummy, another side. Then I go back up to join the head for his feet. I sketch in two lines with three toes in front and one little one behind. Like that. I draw in his wing and some little pointy feathers round his neck. Is he finished? Nope, not yet. He's missing something on his head. You see what it is, my friends? A time! Bravo! So I draw four triangles on the top of the cockerel's head. And I also give him a wattle in the shape of a drop under his beak. Just like that. And now all we've left to do is... Colour it in! Hello, my name is Victor, the handsome, the great, the unforgettable Victor. Victor, my little sister is fast asleep and we have to wake her up. Could you help us? But of course. I am the prince of the farmyard, king of the cockadoodle. Listen to this. Hmm, I heard you sing out of tune. <laughs> Pardon? Yes, all the hens told me that you hurt their ears singing every morning. What, 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 what? That's too, too much. I'm off to have a word with them. <laughs> bye bye. The great, the handsome. Come back, Victor. Victor. Yoko was only joking. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. Louie, I don't see how you can possibly wake up Sophie now. Don't you worry, Yoko. To draw a cockerel, you start with the head, a bit flattened on top. Then you add a little pointy beak and a dot for his eyes. 
after you draw his back and you go straight back up to draw his big tail feathers. And next, you go back down, you draw a thigh, a line for his tummy and another thigh. Then you join up to his head and you sketch his feet with three little toes in front and one little toe behind. Like that. You add his wing and the little points for the feathers on his neck. And don't forget the comb on his head. Or his little wattle under his beak, drop-shaped. After, you can colour him in however you like. Hello, my name's Hugo. Hi there, Hugo. Could you sing to help wake my sister up? It'll be my pleasure. I just love singing. You sing out of tune. tune. I know why. That's why when someone actually asks me to sing, I never ever refuse. Oh no, it's not true. Almost as great as you, Yoko! <laughs> and now, friends, if you'd like to draw a cockerel, have a go! See you soon, my 